I'm stood here next to David Franklin's beautiful Corvette Stingray. As you can see, it is a stunning piece of kit. It looks fit for a museum almost. We're told that it's the first time that a Corvette Stingray will take to a hill climb. And David, uh, going to be making some history today in Class 16. Yeah, it's, uh, it's quite a long, uh, wide car, so it's quite hard around some of the bales and some of the tight corners. It's quite hard. Are you managing to hold back the competitive side of you that wants an overall win and en enjoy the experience of driving I'm this car? I'm here to enjoy the experience. <laughs> yeah, you've got a lot of uh, close competition in your class. There's a lot of cars in your class as well and some real, real quick machinery. Yeah. Who do you see the winner being? Uh, probably Jock in the uh, Manta. He's a very, very accomplished driver, you could say. So he's been doing it for years. I'm not sure if you're playing that down. <laughs> Let's have a little chat about the car, a little bit of a history. I mean, how did you come to own this car? Yeah, I've had it for the last 10 years, been slowly just doing it up for the last 10 years. And I bought it from a, a farmer down in Gallus Shields, and he imports uh, old cars and tractors from America. And I spotted it on his farm in my day-to-day my -day work, and uh, I thought, I want to buy that car. And what kind of condition was it when you bought it? it was, yeah, very bad, yeah, very, very poor condition. Um, so I spent a lot of money and time over the years doing it up so the class 16 invitational runners and here is that corvette c3 in my opinion the 69 stingray just about the second sexiest stingray of all time i'll always prefer the 67 over it personally but what an amazing spectacle the first time as we said that a corvette has ever taken to a hill climb and just listen Noise. I almost don't want to say anything as it goes by. David Franklin serving the crowd up with something very, very special indeed in the Corvette C3. Brilliant to see that thing blasting over the line.